Today I will show you how to get access to the laptop hard drive data. Generally, there are three reasons why you cannot access the data. Logical problem, laptop issue and hard drive failure. In practice, if your laptop does not work, for example, it doesn't start at all, or Windows freezes when attempting to access the drive, it is difficult to detect why it happens. Nevertheless, what the cause of laptop failure is, the solution is to get the hard drive connected to a working operating system, be it a desktop PC or a bootable CD. Uh, in this video, I consider the first option. Shortly speaking, uh, we need to disassemble the laptop, extract the hard drive, and then connect it to a desktop PC. You should do the same if you have uh, accidentally deleted some files, because even restarting Windows uh, writes something to the disk and reduces the chance of recovery. This is my Dell laptop, and now I'm going to disassemble it. Take the plug out of the socket, turn over the laptop, remove the battery. To pull the disk out I need to remove two screws here and here. If you have another laptop it would be better to look for the video on YouTube how to extract the hard drive from your particular laptop. Pull the disk out. Here the disk is. And now we need to connect it to a desktop PC. At this stage you have three options. Use a USB enclosure. Use a USB to set an adapter. Or connect the drive to a PC directly. I choose this adapter which costs about $20. Connect the cable to the disk. and connect it to the PC. Since I use to set adapter is a plug and play device, just open my computer and see if there is a disk here. This is my disk, open it, check data. If data looks ok, save the data to a safe location. If there is no disk in my computer, check disk management and see if there is a disk here. To do this, press WinK together with R and enter in the search field disk mgmt.msc and then press enter. Disk management is launching. Look for the disk. If you see the disk listed here and its file system is raw, you should use Reclaim your file recovery to extract data. If there is no disk in my computer and in disk management, most likely you deal with uh, a mechanically damaged disk. In this case, you need uh, to connect your laptop drive uh, to a PC via SATA port, because SATA handles defective drives uh, better than USB. First, you need to place your computer where it will be located throughout the recovery. That takes about 2-3 hours. I have placed my computer on the table. Also, you need to, uh, to think about electrostatic discharge. The best protection measure is to use a special anti-static wrist strap. But typically, people do not have such a thing at home. Uh, so, I suggest you just touch a metal cover of computer uh, while uh, it is uh, plugged into the socket. Now we need uh, to cut off the power from the computer. Uh, you can either pull uh, the plug out of the socket or just uh, remove a power cable from the computer. I remove the cable. 
Uh, now we need to open the computer. To do this, I need to remove two screws. Remove the cover. Look for motherboard. Here it is. And find a free port on it. Here it is. I take a set of cable and connect my drive to the motherboard. Now I need to connect power to the disk, find a free cable from power supply and connect it to the disk. If there are no available cables, uh, you uh, can use uh, cables from a DVD drive. For example, I could use these cables. Place your drive. I use the book and put the disc on it. Check once again that all cables are connected well. Mm -hmm. And connect power. Press power button. Computer starts. Enter the system. Open my computer and see if there is a disk here. This is my disk. Open it. Check data. If data looks OK, immediately save the data to a safe location. If there is no disk in my computer, check disk management. To do this, press Win K together with R and type in disk MGMT dot MSC. Click OK. Look for your drive based on its size. Or maybe the presence of a recovery partition. If your drive is listed here, create a disk image file. Because mechanically damaged drives may get worse because of wear and tear of repeated retries. Almost any data recovery software can create disk image file. You can use also our reclaiming to create it. And uh, further, you will recover data from this disk image file using Reclaimy file recovery software. If there is no disk in my computer and in disk management, most likely your drive is not do it yourself recoverable. In this case, you need to send your drive to a data recovery lab for investigation. Reclaimy team was with you. See you soon.